Welcome back to 30 Clubs in 15 Days. Derek Shelton in year five, and there is a lot to like here. 14 more wins last year than yeah. the year before. What have you most been encouraged by so far in camp? Well, I think the fact of the additions we've made. You know, we, we have two starters that we added. We added Chapman, we added Grandall, and then our young guys. I mean, I think the one thing that you can never replicate is major league innings, major league at bats, and we were able to get our young guys a bunch of those last year. When you look at this team, you have some youth, you have some veteran uh, leaders. But how do you get these guys to still be uh, aggressive? but not give up outs and do some things we saw last year that sort of hindered you guys. Yeah, I think the biggest thing is our guys kind of learned from that. Last year we started out really aggressive. Yeah. We took really advantage of the rules early on. And then we got a little stagnant. And I think the, the growth that we made, especially in September with some of our young guys coming back to the big leagues, realizing why they struggled, yeah. that's going to help us as we move into 24. We keep trying to find O'Neal. How's he doing? I would imagine <laughs> it's about timing, right? With base running and at the plate. Uh, he's not hard to find. I know. <laughs> Oh, it's just early. Uh, he, he looks good. I mean, he's played in two games. He's moving around. He's healthy. That's the biggest thing. So it's just monitoring, monitoring his volume as we get through the spring to make sure that he gets enough reps. But overall, he's looked good. He had two really good at-bats yesterday where he walked. He showed some patience, which was really important for us because he's missed so much time. You don't want him to rush through things, and he didn't do that. We, uh, talk, we saw Paul Skins. <clears throat> yeah. Cliff and I were like, I was like, hold up. Like, right. a billion. I'm looking him in his eyes. Big. That's, like, that's, that's a large human being. Intimidating. Yeah, I, we, I mean, we're a little different than we were five years ago. Yeah. We walk through it, we have, we have some big men in there. But yeah, Skeens is a big kid. He's really talented. We just have to get him used to the professional game. Right. He threw six innings last year. Mm -hmm. He's never pitched on the rotation of you know being every five days, every six days. I think the one advantage we do have is the pitching coach that he had at LSU, Wes Johnson, who was with me in, in uh, Minnesota as the pitching coach when I was a bench coach. He knows how the major league game works, so I think that kind of expedites his development a little bit, just in terms of the conversations they were able to have when he was in college. And with this team, it's sort of like, is it hard to be patient? Is it hard to be patient when your window opens up for you guys to be good and go giddy? Because that, to me, is like the hardest thing. It's like. Yeah, we want Paul, but like we've got to be patient and, and allow him to sort of grow. Yeah, and I think that goes back to Lauren's last question. Maybe that's the one thing that I have learned the most going through the last four years is patience. We, last year, we took the major step forward in terms of winning 14 right. games. Now we need to take the next step forward. The fact that we were able to get a ton of reps for our guys, that was important. That, that patience may get mm. tested at time. I mean, you know, I'm a little grayer than I was, uh, than, than I was five years ago when it, when, it, when it stopped, but when it started. But I think that's the thing is being patient, but also pushing our group of like, hey, this is what's ahead of you. Right. This is what we can do. And in terms of our players, I think the players will tell us. You know, Skeens will tell us when he's ready. Yeah. Our other players in development will tell us when they're ready. The game tells you that. So that's uh, that, that will probably be the toughest yeah. patience part. Derek, thank you so much for your time. Absolutely. Good luck this season. All right, thank Can't you. Can't talk about you, the man. Pirates you, without talking about the youth, and nobody knows that more than Jim Callis. All prospects all day long. Jim, take it away.